Arriving in the provincial town of La Rioja, France's Consul General in Argentina, Rafael Tranois. The diplomat had little to say, but he is now France's man on the ground, dealing with the aftermath of this terrible tragedy. The accident happened in clear skies, and the two helicopters were flying at relatively low altitude. But for some reason, they collided with disastrous consequences. There was nothing anyone nearby could do. The mangled wreckage of the two Eurocopter A350s was in flames, and everyone on board was dead. The bodies of the eight French nationals and the two Argentine pilots have been brought from the remote location where the accident happened here to a morgue in the regional capital. And it's understood they'll remain here in La Rioja while an investigation into the tragedy gets underway. Among the victims were three of France's best-known sports personalities. Olympic swimmer Camille Mouffat, boxer Alexis Vastin and sailor Florence Artaud. After talks with the regional governor over how the investigation will proceed, the French consul came to pay his respects at the mortuary. But as the diplomat was swept in, outside being consoled by onlookers and still waiting to enter was the partner of one of the dead Argentine pilots. He'd flown with these TV people many times before, in the mountains and without problems, says Asusena Aguero. He was very experienced, a war veteran, and had been flying for 36 years. Amid the clamor from relatives for answers and pressure from France to repatriate the bodies, the reality is that this might take some time. Last night, a presenter from the ill-fated television show announced the program had been suspended out of respect for the victims. For now, the surviving cast and crew will remain in Argentina while police investigations get underway. Ura Davis, BBC News, La Rioja.